Oh yeah, I'll talk to these guys in the back. I'm gonna try this uh, game, let's say, uh, the park. Uh, see what it's like. Uh... Yeah. Okay. Say another, guys. Hello guys, welcome to my channel. This is the first time you're playing this game, so let's hope for the worst. Because I want to get scared. I scared these motherfuckers. Jesus, 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 Jesus. Where's Mr. Bear? I haven't seen Mr. Bear, Callum. Stay in the car. I'll go and ask information. Yes, first person. Can't be in. Whoa, that is so bad sensitivity. Let me just uh, check this. Change this. Ah, it's pushed. Like, why is that so fast? Let's try that. That's better. A lot fucking better. I don't like it when it's too fast. How do you run this? Attention, patrons. The park is now closed. Please make your way to the car park at your earliest convenience. Is it just me? Is this thing just started randomly getting dark? Interact with objects in the world. Alright. Hey, it's a rock. Calum was born the day this place opened. This is his favorite place in the world. Oh, fair enough. Let's go and get, oh shit. Am I going this way? This way? Come on. Let's go. This way? Come on. Open sesame. I think I gotta go in here and do something. Or then you can just walk through one of these. Oh, there's a fucking dude standing there. What? Wow, she's gone nuts. Bro, let's hope this uh, goes well. Bro, let's hope this uh, goes well. Youngs, let's try this, guys. Let's see what happens. Bro, oh, can I get through this one? To wait up there for mommy, Callum. This way. Callum, come over here, Callum. Wait up there for mommy, Callum. Need fire. All right, bro. Can I take this? No. Bro, eh, let's just put that down there. Eh. Enough. Let's do these. 
the most casual to be stuck on that. Oh. There's something special about the entrance to an amusement park. A line drawn between the real world and the world of whimsy within. On this side, the apathy of our everyday lives. And on the other, anything we might dare dream. It's no wonder Cal ran back inside. I wouldn't want to leave either. Attention employees. Cal, where are you going? Have a safe journey home. What's happening here? What the fuck? Whoa, what the fuck? Oh, they're just running the way at midnight. Can't. Oh god. The park. Oh, can run. Sweet. What happened here? Stay where you are. Where are we going? How's the horrors? I want to go that way, but oh well. We'll start going this way. Oh, wait, was that paper on the ground? No. That doesn't look terrifying. I'm not playing anymore, Callum. Fuck. Where are we going? What is that noise? This doesn't look fucking terrifying. Too dark. I'm not going in there without a flashlight. Was it one of them again? Like a flashlight. Kiss bye bye to your funny being type. Don't look for a flashlight. Wait for mommy. This way, mommy. Callum, where did you go? Over here. Where's over here? I think this belongs to Callum. Come out, sweetie. What is this about? Oh, what the fuck is that noise? Let's go on the duck ride. Come on, mommy. Where are you? Oh, Where fuck off, he's a winner. Oh, fuck it, let's, let's ride the swan. Sock. What the fuck are they want to bite or sock? What will become of us? The woodcutter asked his wife one night. I tell you what, husband, we will take the children into the thickest part of the forest tomorrow and oh, abandon what the fuck? them there. No, my wife, I cannot do that, said the man. Then we will all four starve, you fool. 
Hansel and Gretel overheard their parents talking, and Gretel began to weep. Do not fret, Gretel, Hansel said. He crept out of the hut and gathered white stones from the ground to fill his pockets. The next morning, the woodcutter leads the children into the forest. Before they leave, their mother gives them a slice of bread and warns them that they will get no more food that day. Clever Hansel leaves a trail of white stones behind them as they pass into the woods. When their father leaves them, the children wait a while, then follow the trail back to their parents' house. After receiving a thorough scolding from their parents for getting lost in the woods, the children are sent to bed without any supper. Hansel tried to sneak out and collect more white stones, but found that the door was locked. Tomorrow I will take them into the woods myself, the wife told the woodcutter. What a weird way to play this game, eh? In the morning, their mother gave them a slice of bread sake. and led them deep into the forest once again. Alright then. Something's not right here, like. Hansel broke his bread into pieces and left a trail of breadcrumbs to lead them safely home. But hungry eyed birds snatched up the breadcrumbs and his trail was destroyed. Abandoned by their parents and unable to find the trail home, the children wandered in the forest for three days. The children stumbled into a clearing with an exceedingly strange house. Its walls were made of gingerbread, and its windows were panes of clear sugar. Hansel, desperately hungry, ran forward and began to nibble on the walls. Can I just like skip this verse? It's fucking born. At my house, an old woman emerged from the house, sniffing the air and peering around with cloudy eyes. Oh, you dear children, who brought you in here? Just come in and stay with me. No harm will come to you. But Hansel and Gretel stayed back, for the old woman reminded them their cruel mother. Come, children, don't be afraid. I have something for you. The old woman offered them two enormous lollipops. The children took them and began to eat. You see, nothing to fear here. Come inside, the old woman urged, and the children, still licking their sweets, followed. Oh shit. What's that up there? Is that a person? What's happening here? Nice. Time passed, and poor Hansel refused to eat, fearing the day that the witch would eat him. The witch, for her part, grew impatient. Today, I will cook and eat your brother, Gretel. Climb inside and light the oven. But Gretel pretended not to understand. Uh, I do not know how. Where is the opening? The old witch said, The opening is here! And she moved to show Gretel. Seizing her courage, brave Gretel gave the witch a shove, and the old crone tumbled forward into the oven. Gretel slid a large iron bolt over the door to the oven. Gretel freed her brother Hansel, 
and together they lit a fire beneath the oven. And though she screamed and begged, the children sat by the oven until her screams had stilled, and the witch was cooked. And right. then, because even children can't survive on sweets, they divided up the body of the old witch and ate her. <laughs> Yeah, totally. They just fucking start demolishing her. Well, that was a. Oh, what? Uh oh. Uh oh. Okay then. Fair enough. Get me out of this thing, please. Thank you. <laughs> diarrhea, diarrhea. Swans, gingerbread, and. Tunnel of Tails. There isn't the boy. Hansel and Gretel. I used to read it to Cal when the electricity was shut off. Those poor children. The whole world against them. The forest. The birds. The old witch. Even their own parents. I used to imagine that Callum and I were the kids in that story. Not mother and son, but brother and sister. Hand in hand against the unkind world. We were always hungry. Looking for our own house made of candy. Looking for the sweetness that could take the pain away. Hunger leads people to desperate, terrible places where the tree branches reach like claws. Come out, sweetie! Lollipop, lollipop, oh, lollipop. Another accident. This place. Oh, it's Teddy. Hello. Park five. I wonder if I can take what were the fox on that bear? Nah, it's dagger. No. Quite a weird game. It's not really scary, it's more just so far it's a bone. The fuck was that? Wish I had slender tubbies on this, that'd be really cool. Oh hey, that's I wanna show you that like <laughs> Oh, this old thing used to make the blood run to my head. It'd make me dizzy. The guy just snapped. Those poor kids. Can you feel like I'm playing a. Uh, what's it called? Home. Uh, home Sweet Home or something? It's just like. You go in, you could actually complete the game within a minute. Can you feel like that kind of game? Come back, Cal. I can't get on while it's moving. Let's stop it. I want a shot. I want a shot. Sweet, give me a shot. I can't get on while it's moving. Yay! 
what I didn't understand is how is she able to get on that without pushing a button for it to move? That's what I'm not understanding. Wonder if there's any oh there's somebody standing there. The fuck? Riding around, riding around, riding around we go. Oft! Look at that boy! Cowboy needs to hear a teeth massage, man. Guy needs to get new teeth in that car, I mean. Hey guys, for the guys who's watching, please leave a like and subscribe to my channel. Thank you for watching, and I hope you enjoy it because so far this game is actually not very scary. Until now, to see what this guy's doing. It's like just standing there. Hey bro. Let's start it back up, fuck it. Faster, faster, faster! Let's see what the top speed is. Off. Wonder if there's a, an achievement for making it go on way too fast. Flying. Lol. Hey, where am I going? I want to go this way, I think. Actually, is it? Hey, is it not like a... No, there's nothing. Oh, fuck it, I'm going this way then. What's this? These guys want to and watch that. I read that, go for it. I'm not reading it. That looks awesome. Guess I'm gonna go this way. Treachery that lashes like a whip and scars our insides. The first time I saw Calum, my thoughts betrayed me. I looked down at this wrinkled, red, bawling thing and I thought, is that it? We build our world from expectations, and the world that I had built for Callum was no different. He was so real, so there, and so far from my expectations. They shattered, and as they fell in pieces, that one treacherous thought became a new foundation. All of the love that we shared, all of the warmth and goodness that followed, built on a single traitorous thought. Stop! Kill him! Oh, hey. Maybe she can give me a hand or something. Hello. Everything's off a blurry. Hello. I think I'm getting a shot at the bumper cars. Yay! How much I do love the bumper cars. Crashes in 80s music. Guess it floats someone's boat. Yeah, flood your butt, man. Flood your butt. Because it was never. What's this? The fuck? Okay. Cool. Well, man, I got an achievement. Shock therapy. That's a new one. 
Let's jump in a bumper car. Why does it feel like I need to jump in one of these? Oh wait, there's one there. Oh wait, accident. What's happened? Francis was killed, did the injury. If he's seen the employer form, no. Yes. Ah, I don't know. Oh shit. Uh oh, what's happening here? Oh, that must have been like the crash. Like, crash of what happened to possibly her father? Her boyfriend? I don't know. Alan, where did you go? Oh, what? Mommy is coming, what the fuck was that? Someone just like popped out of nowhere and then fucked off again. It's a matter of public record that I am a failure as a mother. Once, when Callum was very small, I left him asleep in the car while I ran an errand. Don't even remember what it was. When I came back, the sheriff was standing next to the car, watching my boy through the window. I didn't like what I saw in his eyes. Judgment. He wrote me the ticket without saying a word. Just the scratch scratch of his pen on the notepad. When he gave it to me, our eyes met. I know what you're going through. My daughter, Helen, she just gets some help. Help was a bolt of lightning. Help was a thousand volts surging through my veins. Help is agony. I'd rather die. I wanted to scream. I'd rather you pulled your gun and shot me. But instead my mouth said, Yes, Sheriff. Fair enough. What's in here? Can I get in there? No. Alan, where did you go? Oh, what? What's... What's really crying? So they are going to close this place down. Doesn't surprise me. Oh yeah, there's no door. Fuck that. Nah, I couldn't do that, fuck. Bet, bet any money, like a guy or something pops out, like, sitting right in front of us. People come into your life for a reason. Dad used to say that before Mom ran off. After that, he mostly just drank. Things were different for Don and I. When we met, I was sweeping the floor at Susie's diner. He came in with some workers, but he didn't try to flirt or cop a feel like the others. He just ordered a coffee and sat there, watching me. When my shift was over, he offered to walk me home. I don't know how to describe that walk. He talked and laughed and eventually kissed. It felt like love. It felt like a fairy tale. I can't tell you if Callum was made that night or one of the ones that followed. But I think it has to be that night. That one perfect night. Don and I moved in together, but then, well, he died. 
According to the supervisor, his safety harness failed when he was working on the top of the Ferris wheel. Don was there one moment, and then gone. Sometimes people leave your life for no reason. I was three months pregnant with Callum. Fairy tale fucking over. I bet that fucking guy that popped up like two minutes ago, I bet he's like sitting, standing in that fucking doorway thing. Watch. What did I sell you? No, oh, I don't want to shoot. Fuck that. Oh no. Oh, no. Bollocks. Oh well. Well, we're currently setting up here, guys. Why don't we just uh, enjoy the view? Also looking for some ideas what to do for my next YouTube video. If any of you can like put some things in the comments, <sighs> that'd be bra, thanks. Fucking hell, how long does it take to get to the bottom? Mind me, I'm never doing this again. I wonder if um, that ugly dude's gonna be standing in the box again. I reckon it will be for some reason. Nah, I thought so. Right, let's fuck off. No one to do that again. Right, see where we're going now. Yeah, you actually feel like someone's watching you on this. Don't be afraid. children. You hear them talking about their kids and just the way they talk? Their fucking voices make me want to vomit. 
My angel likes to read. And little Johnny is so good on the piano. Fuck those people! You give up nine months of your life carrying them. You traumatize yourself giving birth to them. And then you spend the rest of your life as their slave. Wiping asses, mopping a piss, feeding them. Little life-sucking monsters who take and take and take until... We all go insane. Any parent who pretends otherwise is just dishonest. That's called choice supportive bias. I am honest. Callum really grinds my gears, and he owes me everything. Everything. It served the little fuck right if I just abandoned him. Stay where you are! <laughs> Stay where you are! Callum! Tell mommy! I always wanted to ride this one. Never got around to do it before. Mommy is coming, Kelm. Keys are short a uh, roller coaster. Ups and downs. Thank you, dude. What do you want? We need to talk about Kelm. What? What do you mean? What have you done to him? I? That's insulting. You and your boy are everything that this place doesn't want. The antithesis of what we stand for. Where is Calvin? The poor child. He tried so hard to do what he was taught. He even left you a trail of breadcrumbs. But the park is just so hungry. Tell me where my son is. The witch has it now. As both of you. No happy ending here, I'm afraid. Just... just leave me alone. Fool. You always were. Whee! What? Huh? I'm not quite understanding what this happened here. I really get enough time for the read that. Wow, I definitely got to a shot of this again. Like, this is quite fun. Yeah, I'm not understanding that. Like, wait, some fucking tables and chairs that fine. That was fun. Again, again, again. Nah, give it arse, fuck it. Or somebody at the window. Let's check. Got to be somebody at the window. Oh, got to take the pack. Got to take it, and then there's got to be something at the window. I'm not playing anymore, Callum. Breadcrumbs. What the fuck's he on about? He doesn't want to answer me. Something has scared him into silence. He doesn't dare talk. He's been changing too. Something sinister lurks in the darkness behind his eyes. I catch him staring at me at odd moments. In the night, he tosses and turns and cries out words that I cannot understand. When I try to soothe him, he snaps and bites at my fingers. I think he wants to talk to me. I think he wants to tell me. 
They are watching him every minute of every day. They are whispering to him in his sleep, changing him. They are taking my baby away from me. I can't save him. There will be pain. But I love him, and in the end, he will understand why. I can help you, Callum. But I go that way, so. Mm, Cause you taste good, motherfucker. Callum, Callum, keep them away from me. This isn't a game, Callum. What are you scared of? Come back! Don't let the witch put me in the oven. The whole town was shocked by that one. Never found out who did it. It's like a baby. Look at the, the, the face on the left. Looks like he's holding something. You need to be like jump up at me or something. Boom. Holy fuck. Alright, that was a wee bit. A wee bit tangy on me there, like a wee bit too much. I can help you, Callum. Mommy, I'm scared. Mama do the hump, mama do the hump, hump. I'm not playing anymore, Callum. What is that noise? Pals. These are mine. The fuck? Where am I now? Fuck gravity. She. Sheriff ba ba Banner Man is a fat pig, but his can you spell door is hot, not safe. The league. Forgive me, Calm. Stop picking your nose then. Forgive me, Callum. Huh? What the fuck? I'm trapped, Marshall. Huh? Callum, I'm sorry. Wee. Don't touch me. Callum, I'm sorry. That's probably what you like. That's what I have the junkies are in that area like. The gate, I'm guessing. Oh, someone's starting rest. <laughs> what a strange trap it been. Achievement. Contradictions all of its own. Millions of people die every year in car crashes. And the park has little cars designed specifically to simulate that action. Here the children scream with joy. In the sideshow alley, you can walk away with 15 cents worth of mass produced Chinese teddy bears while a grinning carny pockets your hard earned five dollars. What secrets lie beneath the sullen waters of the lake? 
The tears of jilted lovers, the soiled condoms of illicit affairs, the clotted blood of the lonely suicide. And the face of the witch looms over it all. I always despised a toothy grin and warty nose. I hate that sparkle in her weathered, watchful eyes. I think Callum is waiting for me. Inside. Was? Callie, come on, I've seen it all. Callum? Callum! What have you done with him? Wonder if there's anything I could find. Kind of feels like this. This map. I'm not even joking. Feels a wee bit like um. What's the word I'm thinking of? A uh, Bioshock. Literally. Crab. Ooh, the big bullseye guy. What is this one of the mirrors where like somebody's gonna pop out in front of you? There's no. I don't really understand that, right? She's on the other side, but yeah, I'm trying to speak, but nothing's speaking. Doesn't make sense to me, like. Waiting for someone else to pop it in front of me. That. Was that another one of these squirrels? Don't leave me. Why did you steal me? Yeah. Don't leave me. Let's Given to me. Hmm. Hope this other game is scary. There's a chair. I was writing. I knew it was there, I just... I saw it on the floor and I just jumped up at me, fuck's sake. There's, there's got to be something sitting about somewhere, come on. No one's gonna jump out at me, come on. That's the well lies. Come 
Come on, fucking jump over me already. Well, look, there's somebody standing there. I'll go and ask him. What have you done with him? Is that a zombie? Blech. Show yourself. But yeah, yeah. Gonna try a left door? No. This door? No. I always got to be the one in the front, eh? After they let me out, they gave me Callum back and sent me home with a handful of breadcrumbs. Home bit a sweet home. I barely recognized it. Where there had been color and light, there were shadows and regrets. Where there had been warmth, there was a bone-deep coldness that never went away. I tried my hardest to keep the ghosts at bay. Don, watching from the dusty corners while I tried to teach his son to read. My father, coldly assessing me and finding me lacking. I devoted myself to Callum and did the things that they told me. It will get better, they said. Every day will be a little better than the last. I'm in the woods now, lost and afraid. Things never got any better. I love you from Callum. Hmm, <laughs> is it then us? I have to admit, it's quite a basic game. The one that was like two quid. Pardon me. Back on potatoes, fish sticks. Remember, drop off Callum electricity. Okay. Yeah, open the fridge. Better somebody's in here. But weird. Shut the door. One potato, two potato, three potato, four. Who was that? How you that? I just came with your fire face. I can't go out of this gym, what the fuck I'm saying? This looks fun. I saw the fucking notices, they want to read everything. Come on, who's going to be on the bet? Watch this, I'll have to change the TV channel or something. Get you, get you, get you, get you. Left. We're left this time, not. What about now? Left that? Straight on. Feels like we're going back in these rooms again. Nightmare Ruckus. More pills. What if I go back the way? Can I go back the way? No. It kind of feels like we're doing one of the games where you go around in the same, same game like over and over and over again, but things just seem to get worse. Away. 
Thank you, William, for the new watch. It is very nice. It has made me ha a happy carrot. Let's see what this next one's taking me. Downstairs, repeat. Probably the same fucking thing, more likely. Maybe this would be twisted up a wee bit. Maybe they're going to hang each other or some shit. Oh, there's a, there's a bear. Oh, it's got blood on it this time. Her lie. She, was it? She, she lie. She say lie. She. Pure cotton shapes, not. So I'll kind of get through that way. But somebody's hidden this. Okay. Aye, with the devil and I. What's through here now? Oh, someone's there. Yep, that's the dude. What's all these fucking babies? What are the main basic thing about horror games is babies. Hey, look at this guy's. I see you! Literally, I. Babies, babies, do, 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 do. babies, babies, do, 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 do. Watch this. Open the door, big baby. Can't he? Oh, examine. Maybe not. Oh, look, door. Oh, look, door. Oh, look, shut down. Probably the big guy standing somewhere behind me. Fucking door in. Ah, so I thought, fuck you. Oh, we're going this way. Okay, fine, open the door then. Fuck you then. Baby shark. Come on, there's nothing on the tail yet. Come on. It's gonna buy you a mockingbird. You don't you cry. I'm gonna pretend that you didn't die. Body everywhere. Tell you, hang that cell. Hi, how are you doing? Good, thank you. How are you? Just hanging about. Is that noise? Who's in here? Oh, eyeballs in that. Awesome. Wait, what's that? Black King. Oh, they can. Yes. Huh? I thought I just seen something there. Water. Hey, there's water, man. That's water. Who's hanging in here? I don't want to tell you. Fuck's sake. Exit. Bro, let's go. What have you done with him? Again, and from their shape, we build our understanding of the world. 
true children are led into the woods. They are lost for a time, but then are captured by an old witch. The child goes missing in Atlantic Island Park. He wanders lost for a time before finding his way into the mouth of an old witch. In the oldest version of the story, the mother and the witch were the same person. I never wanted to be the witch. But I am, aren't I? Was that like Frank and Sinatra or some bush? Eyes without sparkle. Ooh, I oh, got shivered up my spine now. Don't know why. I'll read this book, turn around, and they'll be standing right behind me. Or not. Even she's checking out her voice. She's gonna fall on her cunt. Mug. What? I did. Meant to be. Nah, thank God I got it quite cheap though. <laughs> I should kill the rain son. Lol. What's this achievement? Fuck off, is that? No way. That's bullshit. That can't be that, is it? That's it. The fuck? I can't it be right. Stories are told again and again, and from their shape we build our understanding of the world. Two children are led into the woods. They are lost for a time, but then are captured. No, I don't understand that. Well, anyway, thanks guys for watching. Uh, obviously, this is pretty boring. So, uh, <laughs> if you enjoyed that, please leave a like. Subscribe as well and uh, put your comments what you thought of the video. 
next I'm hoping to do the next horror game soon. Probably tomorrow. <sighs> yeah, have a good night guys. Thank you for watching. Bye.